your punches above this line. Shake hands. Good luck to both of you. And as the rounds progress, I'll start doing what I need. I want him to think. And Ryan Garcia's finished as a true prospect. And then I can once again be old boxing adage. Now you see that aggressive and veteran move. He wants to score real quick. <laughs> from Ryan Garcia, now he's got a man. That would make Valez be kind of set up a position where they can go ahead and take on the whole title challenger. He said, I'll make my... If he misses and he don't protect himself, the two. If you look at the back of Ryan Garcia, all rounds is going to be a, really a, a round of who going to dictate because he's coming back with something. And just in the right distance to get a punch off, whether it's right hand... The thing about Velez is he came to fight. He's got something. This is where Jason Velez is, is, is really dead. We might see Velez. Pro Korea's got six first round knockouts out of the third. Well, he's got Frida Kahlo. I have a fighter, B Hop. You've been there, done that. As for Henry Garcia, who's also his trainer. Up. Velez wants to get out of suck him into a war. He came out in opponent, opponents before. Uh, the other fighters, and that's something that you would like to see a face once again. And there's a low blow from them. A way of, of keeping them off him, which is not going to be a good thing. The gear. Yes. Ryan Garcia connects with a nice left. But he has to throw more than one. And Valez noted. Looking to prove that he belongs amongst those. Is setting up a right uppercut or a left uppercut. I think that he can just do what he wants to do against Lecking at a fast food chicken place in Puerto Rico. Left hand or right hand, or Valez is going to run right in. Both of these fighters know how they got to win this fight, and also... ...of Jason Velez go a little weak, and here comes... That ...because he hit him with an easy shot, then it's over. Ted Garcia get frustrated, get tired. He's able to create space and try to take advantage of... And he still was training as he was working, and ten more combinations, they just want to see Ryan put three, four at a time. They're like Garcia has to figure out with that right uppercut that nice. I mentioned earlier. Ryan Garcia tried to pull a Muhammad off. This round, and Simalo smothered him. He didn't find Garcia him. sitting in the pocket, and he's content. Sometimes puts undue pressure on a young fighter. But he's, you know what? Punches can change your mind when they hit you. A, a young fighter who believes in himself. Ryan Garcia was supposed to be. I mean, if you can back it up, it all makes it great. He goes back to that. Maybe not right away, but he goes. He is headlining on Golden Boy Boxing on ESPN. He's a more experienced fighter with his 30 per language. Velez got hit with some good shots. And it impresses me about this young man is how he's able to create space. In the middle of the ring. That's ring generalship. When you see Waiting to counter Velez. Like he's expected to be in and to be taking Ryan Garcia in. Thank you very much to our ringside reporter, Beto Duran. And he's got four losses, but he's always seen the final bell. And that's why prospects. But this was once the story of... So far. See right there, another right hand that makes Velez... You see... Axel trying to find a way to count out. All right, Beto, this... Mexico, Puerto Rico on Cinco de Mayo weekend. And you know, we see Garcia as a guy that think he's come by round. How do he change Valez's thinking? And make Valez's observation of... They start going to the body because they see how Valez is trying to... And he's here for a long time. And even though... Go a long way, way past this fight. And, and Ryan Garcia, look at the... Candid, almost twice as many for Ryan Gar Great Garcia time. does that too. So I'm yeah. sure Golden Boy Boxing is happy as punishment. Let's take a look at the total. Ryan Garcia having to think things through here. And he glanced. Also the fight that Jason Velez envisioned. I mean, he... One punch. I think he should add more punches because when he's... A nice uppercut as Velez tried to get aggressive. Other side, that's something that Bernard Hopkins would have pre... Guys, who's going to maul you inside like he's doing. Press forward and do something different or he's going to be... Himself round by round by round because Garcia is going to... Valencia hit with 10 punches, and he takes that play away. But I doubt if he can withstand the speed pressure. It's just basically running into... I make adjustments as the fight progresses. Not so much as yesterday in the meetings that he knew that Ryan Garcia never got extra... Throw punches as Valencia's walk in like he's doing now. Up with maybe another right uppercut because he's seen another guy, a prospect like Garcia. He's going to... Oh, a couple of rounds 
early. Of the face of Jason Velez. In the Matador there in that scene where Velez, the corner, did a good job in terms of that. But there's that overhead. Kim do tonight. And nice left hook. Throw a, a left hook in a left hook position. The percentage at 28. He's got some. Our lightning quick. You can get away with it. What's it like when you succeed in doing what you... You got to change up from just hitting me with an uppercut. From Garcia, it's like a whip. When he throws it... Conditioned. I stopped working at the fast food place. I dedicated myself to... Throw a punch to make him pay. You make him miss, you make him pay. Forward ...that Ryan Garcia will have to deal with, as Vela said... All right. Ryan Garcia with his back to the... If Ryan Garcia rounds, experience ever took a step back and get frustrated, and that's what I've been into. Deep waters, that is. <laughs> uh, but you know, Garcia's had no points, but both guys, even Valen. Moving laterally, trying to get a little fancy. He's in for a fight this evening. What I like about Valez, but I'm, I'm really pleased at Garcia. Dialistic boxing, they want a war. You know, he's not as talented. All of Garcia is aware what he's doing. Ryan Garcia. Coming forward, rushing to the corner, and just let all his hands go like he tried to. Oh, big right hand from Ryan Garcia. Coming to you from the StubHub Center in Carson. Because this is a tough fight. I know what I have to do. Is that we've seen knock other guys out or yep. down. Bills, no life jacket, no floaties. This Ip Center wearing overalls, and when I went into the locker where he really gets to prove who he is. Ryan Garcia, a true, you know, young, don't know, backs his hand, put his hands down, back prospect, put in a workman like that. You've got power, but I can take your shots. If I was in his weight division at this stage of his young career, that he must protect himself, and one shot could have changed everything. It's an impressive performance, nonetheless, from Ryan Garcia. I haven't been... <laughs> the businessman, Bernard Hopkins, as this fight punches just over 500 thrown, 150. Ryan Garcia!